What's up guys, it's Fired Kids here and I, I'm absolutely pumped to give you this video today. Halo 5! Oh my god! I'm absolutely ecstatic, like, no gameplay, nothing. But we have got oh, the one, the only. We've got a member of from Microsoft. Bonnie Ross, General Manager from 343 Industries. Come out and say, we have Halo 5. We have Halo 5 Guardians and now... Halo 5 Guardians will be on Xbox One, probably exclusive to Xbox One. Now, this is the piece of concept art that we have got of Halo 5. Um, well, not concept art, this is this is legitimate artwork here. And you can see there's a picture of, presumably, perhaps the Guardian um, standing above Master Chief, which has been reflected underneath. Um, now, I'll just read you, before I go into my uh, awesome piece of information, which I'm actually so pumped to tell you, I don't know if you can tell by my voice, I'm so pumped to tell you, I'm just going to read you what, um, uh, what this, uh, but what Bonnie Ross actually said, um, uh, this is a good bit, Halo 5 Guardians is a much bigger effort than Halo 4, this, that applies to the content and scope of the game, as well as the technology which is now a brand new and more powerful engine, stop, that means that Halo 5 will actually be good. <laughs> that means a bigger effort than Halo 4. Bigger effort. So that means uh, it's content and scope of the game. So content, so you're looking at more online, more uh, perhaps firefight stuff coming back. Um, the uh, the campaign being better. I'll get onto the campaign a bit later. And uh, technology in, which is now brand new and a more powerful engine. Now, that means you're going to see Halo 5, 60 frames per second, 180p on the Xbox One. It is a massive and exciting project, he also says. Certainly there'll be some core elements carried over from prior games. Now, please, 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 take out Infinity Slayer. Take out the Ordnance Drops. Uh, if that, if Ordnance Drops were, are not in the game, I will literally kiss... I will... I will... I don't know what I'll do. I'll probably molest my Xbox, okay? I will molest my new Xbox One. And, oh man, I will be so goddamn happy! But we've invested a huge effort in retooling our tech to take full advantage of Xbox One hardware and ecosystem to create worlds and experiences worthy of next gen. Now, notice he says create worlds and experiences worthy of next gen. Worlds. That means, I think, and people have been hinting at this, that Halo 5 may be an MMO. It might have a massive, it might be a, it might be a little bit like Destiny, if you like, a massive open world game. <laughs> And um, obviously take full advantage of Xbox hardware. I've been through that. 60 frames per second, 180p. Um, obviously, 343 have learnt from um, <coughs> Halo 4, definitely. And you can tell this. Um, uh, also, he speaks about 2015. Won't simply so be the year of Halo 5 Guardians. So, Halo 5 Guardians coming out fall of 2015. My guess is probably November, because that's when all the games come out, it seems. It will also be a year that offers us a uni unique opportunity. The opportunity to invite old friends and new audiences into the universe through the Halo television series. Uh, the collaboration between Steven Spielberg. So we already knew that. We already knew that the, um, the Halo TV series was coming back. However, 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 this is also brilliant news. He also said at E3, he spoke of a journey rather than destination, and that journey definitely, definitely begins in 2014 with a giant leap rather than one small step. We'll give you much more about of information on our plans for this year's Xbox E3 on June 9th, <clears throat> and we're confident that Halo fans will be pretty excited about the special plans we have in store. That pretty much confirms Halo 2 anniversary. I'm, I'm going to stamp it. I'm going to stamp it. That I stamped it. You, you didn't see, but I stamped it. Um... So there obviously is going to be a Halo this year. Perhaps it might not be Halo 2. It, this is what people haven't actually considered thoroughly yet. It could be a Halo 5 beta. I know it would be stupidly early, but perhaps Halo 5 beta. Anyway, on to the breakdown of the picture that we have. Um, uh, I'm just going to get it up on my screen. Um, well, first of all, yeah, I talked about the picture. It's in a desert environment, as you can clearly see. Um, with, obviously, I guess it is the Guardian standing over Master Chief. Uh, oh, wrong one. There we go. Master Chief. And, oh, wait for it to load, wait for it to load. Okay, yeah. And you can see that Master Chief is being reflected below. Now, that is a strange sort of concept because Master Chief is normally above everything else. Uh, above the leader. 
but, 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 now this is, this is the bit that I've been waiting to tell you guys all this time. Look at the weapon that the Guardian is carrying. That is clearly a, um, BR, a, I forgot, a battle rifle. That is what he's carrying. He's carrying a UNSC weapon. And look at the armour as well. The armour set clearly looks like Master Chiefs from previous games. I don't know if I can, wait, let's just turn the picture around. Uh, for for myself, you won't be able to see this. Um, you might be able to. Uh, Ad Master Chief's armor looks new and different to previous games. It really does. But the Guardian's armor, it looks like he's some sort of scout sort of person. He looks quite lightweight. His uh visor is clearly blue, quite shining as well. Um, I don't know why that is. Uh, perhaps that means something. But the BR is key. So you could be the Guardian, perhaps. Halo Five Guardians. That's like. Oh, I don't know, like Star Wars, Old Republic or something, you know what I mean? Oh no, what was it called? Lego Universe, that's what it was. That Lego game for the PC. Um, so that's what, I think that's sort of imitating that you might not, you might, you might play as Master Chief, you might not. Maybe your character will be like that. I don't know. Um, the, I'm just purely speculating here, but the BR, that is something to be, uh, something to be recognised, you know what I mean? Uh, put your thoughts in the comment section below because I'm so pumped to see what you guys think of this. Um, the BR is obviously there. His armor set is so much like a Spartan. He walks like a human. His arms are like humans, quite muscly as you can see there. The helmet, slightly smaller than Chief's. Uh, Chief, as you can see, is now carrying the assault rifle and oh, he uh, he's, sort of, he's sort of looking out to the distance. Yeah, look, he's looking away from the camera, whereas your Guardian is looking straight at the camera. He he is looking straight into the middle of the photo. Now I don't know if that's for anything, um, any reason. Also, the background, the background. What does that remind you? What movie does that remind you of? For me, Star Wars, the Episode One, the Pod Race. You can see the the dust environment, the high building, and like in the very very background, you can see on the back right, you can see high skyscrapers. I don't know if they're skyscrapers or rocks, but they do not look like rocks to me. They're too tall to be rocks, and oh, I think they're buildings. Um. Of course, I'm only purely speculating here. I'm just gonna see if there's any more pictures up on uh, up on Google about Halo Five Guardians. Uh, here we go, Guardians uh, images. Let's have a look. See what we have. Um, I thought that was a piece of concept art, but obviously not. I'm quite a lot wrong. Um, but anyway, guys, I am absolutely thrilled to bring this to you. Um, you don't know how overwhelmed I am. I'm. I know we haven't seen any gameplay or anything. But trust me, I am one hyped. I'm probably one of the happiest people alive right now. And it seems sad, I know, but come on. Jump on the hype train, people. Anyway, uh, that's all from me. I don't want to keep this too long. It's already gone over eight minutes, which is longer than usual. But just turned out information, information. Anyway, what do you think about the battle rifle? Is that going to be a playable character that you, you see at the top of your screen? Is it going to be like the Arbiter, like a chief sidekick? Or is it going to be a, the enemy, the bad guy, the big mofo that will literally slap you he looks he looks the didact oh no I, I won't i won't go into detail but i was gonna say it looks badass like the didact did before he took off his armor anyway that's all from me guys i hope you have enjoyed i certainly have literally fisting you with information um anyway guys and i'll see you guys all next time peace out